Now to the Republican side and Donald Trump racking up a win in Oregon overnight as he sits down with Megyn Kelly and goes on the attack not just against Hillary Clinton but also her husband. ABC's Tom Yamas is here with the latest on all of that. Good morning, Tom. Amy, good morning to you. Donald Trump revealing some insight into how he thinks and the reasoning behind some of his outrageous stunts. And there was one uncomfortable moment in that interview when Kelly asked Trump about calling her a bimbo on social media. And I view myself as a person that, like everybody else, is fighting for survival. Overnight, this Donald Trump and Megyn Kelly head to head. When I'm wounded, I go after people hard, okay? And I try and unwound myself. Their first interview since this explosive moment at that Republican presidential debate nine months ago. You've called women you don't like fat pigs, dogs, slobs, and disgusting animals. Your Twitter account Only has Rosie several... O'Donnell. For the record, it was well beyond Rosie O'Donnell. Yes, I'm sure it was. Your Trump telling Kelly he thought it was an unfair opening question and retaliated, including with name-calling retweets. Embo? Uh, well, there was a retweet. Yeah, did I say that? Many times. Ooh, okay. Excuse me. <laughs> what do you think with, I mean... Not the most horrible thing. You know, again, politically, not the most... <laughs> over your life, Megan, you've been called a lot worse. Is that right? Wouldn't you say? You know, you've had a life that's not been that easy. And It's not about me. It's not, it's not about me. It's about no, the, the no, messaging to, no, no. to young girls and yeah. to but again, other it's, women. It's a certain amount of fighting back. You know, it's, it's a modern-day form of fighting back. I mean, it really is. And even though he's the presumptive Republican nominee, Trump telling Kelly this. If I don't go all the way and if I don't win, I will consider it to be a total and complete waste of time, energy, and money. To get there, Trump will have to get past the Democrats. A super PAC supporting Hillary Clinton now releasing this ad using Trump's own words on women. I view a person who is flat-chested is very hard to be attacked. Trump responding on Twitter, posting, amazing that crooked Hillary can do a hit ad on me concerning women when her husband was the worst abuser of women in U.S. political history. Former President Bill Clinton refusing to play Trump's game. I think people are smart enough to figure this out. Right? Helping Trump, his wife Melania, defending him in De Jour magazine. Melania saying in part, he's not Hitler. He wants to help America, bring people together, and bring jobs back. And this morning, Trump set to meet with former Secretary of State Henry Kissinger. The meeting coming just as Trump said in an interview he would be open to speaking with an infamous leader we have no diplomatic relationship with, North Korean leader Kim Jong-un.